in what time will 100 rupees become 121 rupees at 10 percentage per annum compounded annually? Solution. Principle is equal to 100 rupees, amount is equal to 121 rupees, rate of interest R is equal to 10 percentage, time is equal to and years. Amount is equal to principal into 1 plus rate by 100, whole power n. Substituting values in the problem. 121 is equal to 100 into 1 plus 10 by 100, whole power n. 121 is equal to 100 into 110 by 100, whole power n. 121 by 100 is equal to 11 by 10, whole power n. We can see that 121 can be factorized into 11 into 11 and 100 into 10 into 10. 11 into 11 divided by 10 into 10 is equal to 11 by 10, whole power n. 11 by 10, whole square is equal to 11 by 10, whole power n. Comparing the left side with the right side of the equation we can see that n is equal to 2. So, 100 rupees becomes 121 rupees when compounded annually for 2 years when the rate of interest is 10 percentage. Let us see another example. In what time will 400 rupees become 625 rupees at 25 percentage per annum compounded annually? Solution. Principle is equal to 400 rupees, amount is equal to 625 rupees, rate of interest R is equal to 25 percentage, time is equal to and years. Amount is equal to principal into 1 plus rate by 100, whole power n. Substituting values in the problem. 625 is equal to 400 into 1 plus 25 by 100, whole power n. 625 is equal to 400 into 125 by 100, whole power n. 625 by 400 is equal to 25 by 20, whole power n. We can see that 625 can be factorized into 25 into 25 and 400 into 20 into 20. 25 into 25 divided by 20 into 20 is equal to 25 by 20, whole power n. 25 by 20 whole square is equal to 25 by 20 whole power n. Comparing the left side with the right side of the equation we can see that n is equal to 2. So, 400 rupees becomes 625 rupees when compounded annually for 2 years when the rate of interest is 25 percentage. Let us see another example. In what time will 625 rupees become 676 rupees at 4 percentage per annum compounded annually? Solution. Principle is equal to 625 rupees amount is equal to 676 rupees rate of interest R is equal to 4 percentage time is equal to and years. Amount is equal to principal into 1 plus rate by 100, whole power n. Substituting values in the problem. 676 is equal to 625 into 1 plus 4 by 100, whole power n. 676 is equal to 625 into 104 by 100, whole power n. 676 by 625 is equal to 26 by 25, whole power n.
we can see that 676 can be factorized into 26 into 26 and 625 into 25 into 25. 26 into 26 divided by 25 into 25 is equal to 26 by 25, whole power n. 26 by 25, whole square is equal to 26 by 25, whole power n. Comparing the left side with the right side of the equation we can see that n is equal to 2. So, 625 rupees become 676 rupees when compounded annually for 2 years when the rate of interest is 4 percentage.